And then I started to add up these questions and I talked to my colleagues and they had questions. So I immediately went to council and said, we need to consult with the people again. I think this is one of the most important meetings that Sycamus has ever had. When you look back when the other bridge was built, there would not have been a public meeting. And hopefully this meeting and the ones that are, have a petition going will keep the momentum going and keep the pressure on the government to consider the options. And, and it's a decision that'll be long term, we'll never be able to change it. Highways, Ministry of Transportation will never open that entrance again to the Trans Canada. Once that's done, it's a done deal. So we got to think hard on it. And I think, and I know people don't want to drag this out, we like to put it to bed, put it to rest, but it's such a huge implication for the community. Uh, I would appreciate it if Council could, at the minimum, get from this meeting that we think more about this, that we consider more about this. It's, it's too important to just say, I love the Main Street Bridge concept, or I hate it. It's more than that. It's for the cost for the future, it's for the implications for the quality of our lifestyle in this town. What I don't like is hearing things, we're going to negotiate, we're going to negotiate, we're going to negotiate. We have no guarantees. Uh, as far as I'm concerned, the costs that are involved in those bridges are none of our concern, they're Mahdi's concern. Mahdi took away the bridge down there. They left us with an octopus. 50 years later, they fix it. Well, that's really good planning. I'm part of the uh, no to Main Street Bridge. Um, maybe not for the reasons that some of you think. I am an owner at Portside, but that is not the only reason. It is one of the reasons that I am against the Main Street Bridge. But as the fact sheets that we've put out that some of you may not believe in, they are the points to ponder and I want people to think about it. I've heard a lot of questions being asked tonight about what would a Main Street Bridge look like. We have not been able to get any information from the Ministry of Transportation on what the actual footprint would look like. And I'm not supporting, yeah, I'm not telling you to support either one or anything here. I'm just saying do your own research because there's been so many facts, so-called facts posted which are impossible to be real. Get the facts. Don't, don't start running off with uh, ideas that you think. Get the facts. We haven't got all the facts. That's my one comment was, is I've gone out in support of option three, which is the Main Street Bridge. I don't know if it's feasible. If we don't have that information, how can we make decisions now? Because they're looking for guidance from the community to, to, to say, the community is in favor of moving forward and pursuing option three. It's in favor of pursuing one or two. How can we do that if we don't have enough information? You know, from Splat Chain, we're just like you right now. We're in consultation phase. We're asking our people, what do you think? We've got the same, the same storyboards at Splat Chain. And we, we sit there with our people and we go through each one. And we haven't made a decision yet. Yeah, that's, uh, you know, there's been a lot of good words, a lot of, a lot of powerful words here. You've got to stay open-minded to make an educated decision. So, I can assure you folks, and this is from the administrative side, that MOTI is only a first base. They are at the preliminary concept stage. They haven't even begun to make it to second base yet. The three options are in concept form, conceptual engineering, final design are still years away, construction is tentatively scheduled for 2019-2020. So this, con this uh, town hall meeting tonight has given us more information. We've heard from a lot of you. There's been some for, some against, we're looking at different options, but there is still a lot of discussion to be had with the Ministry of Transportation. So we're a ways away from the fence and we will be having more town hall meetings, but I want to thank you once again for being here tonight and having this conversation. We so, so appreciate it. Thank you.